You probably know the rest, the story by now. There have been two financings since our seed, both at prices over 10 times the previous round. The company has some serious market momentum. This is one of my favorite charts, courtesy of Mary Meeker. It shows the number of photos uploaded per day by three leading apps, Facebook in the green, sorry, in the blue, Instagram in the yellow, and Snapchat in the green. When we initially invested in Snapchat, if you remember, there were, we were uploading about 10 million photos per month. This chart was made in May of 2013, and it shows them uploading 200 million photos per day. In September, the company reported that they were uploading 350 million photos per day. And in October, the company introduced Snapchat Stories, which allows users to combine multiple pictures into a story and have them viewed by friends for 24 hours. Is it possible that we'll see a billion photos uploaded per day? One of the cool parts of being an investor in Snapchat is hearing about some of the secret capabilities that they've built into the product. For instance, secret screens is a feature that allows you to apply a filter to your Snapchat by typing B&W for black and white or negative followed by dot, dot, dot. Evan and Bobby added this feature and only told Evan's teenage sister who was in high school so they could watch how fast it spread across their user base. He then told us about the feature a few weeks later, and when I would explain this feature to teenagers and young adults, they would look at me like I was some kind of prophet, clearly a passionate user base. So I don't know where all this is headed, but Lightspeed is very happy to be the first investor in Snapchat, and those teachers at St. Francis High School are giddy to see that their $15,000 investment is valued at over two million dollars. Of course, we're talking about illiquid values, so let's not get carried away. But for me, there's three takeaways from this unlikely set of circumstances. Number one, it pains me to say it, but listen to the input of a teenage generation who so readily accepts and embraces new digital media technologies. Number two, the best mobile apps have a growth trajectory that is both unpredictable and unmatched by any other digital media platform. And number three, which is, I think, relevant also to this audience, in a time when anyone can be an entrepreneur, some of the very best are coming out of college. In closing, I feel extremely fortunate because for my daughter and me, Snapchat has been a unique and rewarding experience that we'll share forever, even after the picture goes away. Thank you.